What's up guys? We are going to be doing a taste testing video today. Um, we are sporting some wear from a place up at the mall. It's called Chocolate Moonshine. Um, none of the chocolates that we are going to be tasting today is alcoholic. However, they are named after some Actually, alcohol products. they're made with alcohol. But what a lot of people may or may not know when you cook with alcohol, the actual alcohol get, uh, evaporates. Yes. You know. So, so, I mean, yes, it is cooked with alcohol. I'm sorry. I should have said that. But um, it's not, per, there's no alcohol in it per se. It's just, it may or may not taste like alcohol. Um, now, it is, how, how I got what she, what I got from where, how she described it yesterday was she ended up going and getting, like, they boil the alcohol until it evaporates, but as they're boiling the alcohol, the alcohol gets hot and it heats up the chocolate and then that's how they make the chocolate, I guess. Um, I think that's how I got it yesterday. Yeah, I, I wasn't real clear on it. Yeah, um, I, I really wasn't sure about yeah, it at all. Yeah. Um. But, but we did, but we did get to taste test a little bit while we were there, and and what we, yeah, I, you can, um, like some of the stuff had bourbon in it, and yeah. even though the bourbon was no longer in it, you could really taste. No, no Chris, uh, uh, wasn't real crazy about a couple of the <laughs> no. things that we tasted with bourbon in it, but no, it didn't bother me. But for him, it was a little too strong, so you have to be a little careful. Yeah. But what was really nice is. Um, they do let you taste test this stuff before you buy it. So, yeah. you know, if there's something that you're, you're just not quite sure of, like um, I suffer from chronic migraines, and even though I love cinnamon, um, cinnamon triggers horrible migraines for me. <clears throat> and Chris had wanted to pick up one with cinnamon in it, and I said, oh, I don't know. So he taste tested it, and he was like, oh, no. That was so strong. Like, yeah. it was really, really cinnamon, and I actually, like, had it in my mouth for about two or three seconds, and I had to throw it out. Oh, yeah. He it, spit was <laughs> it was bad. It was quick. <laughs> yeah, he spit it out right away, and I was like, oh, I'm glad you tasted that before we got it, because, I, you know, it would have brought on, like, an instant migraine for right. me. Right. So. So, anywho, the flavors we are going to be trying today, like, I got a 10-pack plus... She gave us two because we did spend a lot of money there yesterday, and I do not feel comfortable yeah, with saying shirts. how much <laughs> money I spent. But we did get shirts, and they were they were good. Like the everybody there, like she was really really nice. And so shout out to Chocolate Moonshine, um, awesome product. Yes, awesome, awesome. awesome. And um, they also have fudge there, by the way, too. Yes, and, and we did taste test that, and yeah. it was really good. The black cherry bourbon was. Very, very strong with the fudge. We yeah. did not, however, that's actually my first flavor is black cherry. And um, so that's one of the flavors we are going to be tasting first. So I think the way I'm going to do this is we got, I got a 10 pack plus two. She got a 10 pack plus two. And oh, by the way, my name's Missy. <laughs> yes, this is Missy. <laughs> um, if she wants her Facebook, labeled underneath of this i will put her facebook in it um she does make jewelry she makes um go ahead just tell them what oh, you make um, <laughs> jack of all trades i do i do just about everything <laughs> yeah you know so, I, I, mean, sew, I make jewelry <coughs> with just about everything yeah so i mean so i think how we're gonna do this is we're gonna go and i'm gonna pick we're gonna go from my first flavor to her first flavor, to my second flavor, to her second flavor, if that makes any sense. So I'm gonna do my first flavor, and then she's gonna go and do her first flavor. Which is? I'm gonna be doing black cherry, and she's gonna be doing um, whatever her first flavor is. Uh, which... Mine is cranberry pomegranate, which sounded really good. Yeah, so then I'm going to be doing my second, then she's going to be doing her second, and then we both have two little slivers cut off of each of our chocolate bars, so we can both have a try. Um, yeah, we pre-did that, because Chris came up with a really good idea, it would help save time on the video. <coughs> we pre-did that already. Yes. So. Excellent um, idea. Thank you. <laughs> so well, you're you're more professional with this. This is my first time. So. Oh, I, I try to be. Um, I do have some other videos online um, on YouTube. 
Um, my Facebook, my Instagram, and my Twitter will also be listed below if you guys care to follow me on any of those. Um, if you guys haven't already, go ahead down to the subscribe button and click the little bell notification and you will get notified about all the videos that I post. If you guys don't want to get notified about the videos that I post, you guys can go ahead and feel free to subscribe. You won't be notified, but I will be posting on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter every time I post a video. I forget my Twitter login. I got to really figure out. <laughs> and I have Instagram too, and I, I can't remember what that is either. Well, You're going to have to school me on all this stuff. I signed up for it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> we might have to make another one. So we'll, we'll, yeah, we'll yeah. find out. Um, but if she wants to, I will list her Facebook below so sure. she can sell some uh, crafts and whatnot. So um, without further ado, let's get this started. Yeah, I'm let's anxious. Let's do this. I'm yes. anxious. Especially after the taste test yesterday. That oh, yes. really good. Yes. And we do have plates here. Yeah. Um, just <laughs> You can even see where we cut them. Yeah. <laughs> just in case if we feel the need to spit them out, I might. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. I didn't think to get us little napkins. And yeah. Stuff, so. yeah. I don't know. However, I do not have a drink, so I will uh, be doing this. I have this. water. I have, I have bottles of water. You want a bottle of water? That's fine. I mean, I don't care. She was okay. going to disappear for a second. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> so, my my list is going to be black cherry, fudge brownie, mint chocolate, chocolate espresso, banana, fresh orange, bam, triple chocolate. Um, that is all one flavor, though. Um, candy cane, mango, gingerbread, and then the two extra ones are almond and amaretto. I'm back! Did you miss me? <laughs> okay, there's your water. Thank you. And, and then hers are cranberry pomegranate, black raspberry, Belgian chocolate, mocha madness, dark pistachio, which I will probably end up spitting that one out. Irish I, cream for I, all us Irish people. Yes. <laughs> and and I, do, I do not like pistachio, so that might be it. Um... It's like she said, Irish cream, and then the moonshiner, the pina colada, chocolate cheesecake, sea salt, caramel. Caramel. Is that what that says? Yeah. yeah. Uh, toasted coconut and latte, latte macchiato. macchiato. Yeah. So <laughs> let's let's get this done, and I hope you guys enjoy. So the first one is going to be black cherry, which I cut little pieces off. She cut bigger pieces off of hers. I promised my grandma I'd have to share some with her, so that's why I cut little pieces. So Me, I'm a woman, it's chocolate. <laughs> I wanna taste. <laughs> so this is the black cherry. Okay, chocolate covered cherries. That's what I'm gathering so far. Ooh. It's not bad. It's not bad, but that was, I got, it's strong. It seems like with the black cherry, you can taste the bourbon with either the fudge or the chocolate. It doesn't hit you right away. It hits you like later on after a couple, yeah. couple chews. So he's not liking it. I do like it. I'm not a big drinker, guys. So if I end up spitting one out that tastes like. I haven't drank in years, but I do like that one. Yeah. I mean, it, it was good. It tasted like chocolate covered cherries at first, and then I got the hint of bourbon. It was. See, uh, you know, and that was like yesterday you had a problem with the bourbon one, and I didn't. But the one yesterday was fudge. The, and the fudge, well, the fudge was a lot stronger, <coughs> but I think you took a bigger piece of it, you know, a bigger mm -hmm. bite than I did, where I took a smaller bite because she did say it was stronger. Yeah, it was very, very strong. So that one was good. Um, it still tasted a little bit like bourbon, but it was. I do a lot milder. I do think if you took a bigger bite, the bourbon would be a lot stronger, too. Yeah. So. However, yeah, I, we did would, take slivers off the end, so yes. it's not directly from the middle. Yeah. So, so. I, that's something I would suggest is, you know, um, you, yeah, you might want to take, you know, if you're not really into bur a bourbon-y taste, you might want to take smaller, smaller yeah. slivers. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, the one I, my first one is... Cranberry pomegranate. No, I love pomegranate. And I don't and like I, cranberries. Well, <laughs> I'm not a real big cranberry person, but I like cranberries when they're mixed with things. You know, like yeah. when I drink uh, cranberry juice, I always get it mixed with like cranberry raspberry or cranberry pomegranate because then you don't really taste the cranberry. Yeah. So, so there's your piece, honey. Okay. 
So cranberry pomegranate. Yep. Wow. Now see, I tasted the bourbon more with that one. That hit my tongue and it was like. And, yeah, I instantly tasted the bourbon with that one. Oh. Wow. Yeah. And it took a while to taste the pomegranate. Oh. Wow. That was strong. Yeah. Now, my slivers are a little bit bigger. Not hugely bigger, but a little bit bigger than his. Mm hmm. And I did taste the bourbon <coughs> a bit quicker on mine. Yeah. And it took a while to taste the pomegranate, which I'm a little bit disappointed in. Yeah. You know. That was. I mean, it wasn't bad. Don't get me wrong. It was good. It was good. So. But oh, and I'm, I'm. You can't see him, but I'm drinking coffee. <laughs> the my next one is gonna be fudge brownie. Oh, fudge. Yes, fudge brownie. Mm, oh. Can't go wrong with fudge brownie. At least I think. <laughs> I can't taste it yet. That's good. Oh my. Mm. That is so good. Mm -hmm. So fudge brownies definitely. Yeah, see this is, this is, um, oh, well, we should mark these too. Yeah. In case we want to get some more. Um, yeah, I, I didn't like the black cherry. I did though. So I should mark, I should write that down that I like the black cherry. All right, I'm just going to, I'll just write the names down. But we both like that one. It seems to take take just a wee bit. It does. It doesn't. You, you know. I guess it. Like I said. I guess it again depends on how big of a little how chunk of, yeah. you 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 know. And neither one of us liked the pomegranate one. That was yeah. boo. <laughs> <laughs> I put an X beside it, but boo. Um, so your second flavor. <coughs> excuse me. Um, so I guess it really depends, you know, if you have a smaller little chunk, then it takes a little while for, for the flavor to get through. Okay, so now my next flavor is black raspberry. Oh, no, this is going to be good. I think so. I love raspberry, so. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. Mm. That's oh, good. Oh, my God. That is a definite love, 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 love. Oh my god, I love that. That mm. was good. So it definitely had the raspberry taste to it. That is definitely a thumbs up. That has a very good I raspberry. I might just go and get a 10-pack of that next time. That is a very good, good raspberry taste. So my third one is going to be mint chocolate. I'm sorry if I'm like seeming like I'm flying through this. My memory card only holds like 45 minutes worth of stuff, so I'm trying to get through this because there is a lot of stuff to taste, so, and I want you guys to get the full, like, the full effect and everything. Um, so the next one I have is mint chocolate. Is he ding in the trash? No. Uh, he was talking about my cat, by the way. Yeah. No, his, <laughs> his, 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 um... Are you sure? Yeah, his bowl is over there that has oh. his little cat uh, canned cat food in it. Oh. So it might be blocking his food bowl. Mm -hmm. so. Well, this is mint chocolate, and okay. let's. Holy freaking mint! Yeah. It tastes like an Andy's candy. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it does. It does. It's not bad. No. That's good. But that's exactly what it tastes like is an Andy's candy. That's... Oh, that's Did so good. Did you need good. a pencil? Yes. So, yeah. check mark on that one. Yeah, I was trying to... I was trying to figure it out. I'm like, I know this taste. <laughs> I just had an Andy's candy like two days ago, so... I really like that. That is really good. That one's good. Okay. I'm trying not to chug my water. <laughs> oh, I got plenty more. I got like two or three, three cases there. Okay. Now, not, my next one is Belgian chocolate. Now, I'm really thinking that this should be really good because Belgian chocolate is usually really good. Yes. Belgian and Swiss and whatever, they always have really good chocolate. Oh, it's hard. Mm-hmm. 
The outside is. The inside's really soft and creamy. That's good. Mm hmm. Mm. That's so. That's good. Mm hmm. That's real good. It tastes like a dove almost. It does. It really does. Mm. So I'm that, very, very good with candy. <laughs> so that's a definite love too. Oh my god. <coughs> okay, mm. so my next one is chocolate espresso. I can't wait to try this. I one. love, love coffee. Me too. Well, obviously, like a sheet, <laughs> like a sheet's coffee. Oh, sheet's coffees are the best. Um, so, and it's it's so funny because you know I, I bought this coffee coffee pot that um, you can do the single K cups or the single ground on one side and the 12 cup on the other side. So now I have like 12 different flavors of coffee. <laughs> so yeah, I love coffee too. Chocolate espresso. Oh, sorry, I already put no, my hand. <laughs> oh my mm. God. I like that one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Definitely, I like that one. Oh, that is so good. Oh, even after. I don't want to swallow it. It tastes so good. I know. You know, it tastes good at first. And then as you keep eating it, it just gets better. Yeah. I really it's like so that. Good. Oh, my God. Wow. I really like that one. Oh, my God. She spelled banana wrong. <laughs> <laughs> well, my next, my next chocolate, she spelled wrong. So, we're going to do her number four next. And then... His it's okay. One. Yeah, His it's a, it's okay. It's okay. We all have that moment where we just misspell something wrong, and uh, you know, hey, I call them brain farts, and I have them all the time. My, so. Listen, my smartphone spells out stuff for me, so <laughs> if, ever, if ever I'm having like a horrible texting day, I don't have to worry about it. <laughs> so. Okay, so my next one is Mocha Madness, and my favorite kind of coffee. Everybody can attest to this one. Everybody knows it's Mocha. Uh, he can tell you, we went into Sheets one night, and Sheets is having, right now, uh, I think they're still having it, peppermint mocha in their cappuccino machine. I was so ticked off, because the one in Rochester's stupid peppermint mocha wasn't working, it was just coming out water. I was so mad. <laughs> <laughs> so, I love mocha coffee. So, so let's... Mm. <sighs> mocha Madness. It takes a little while to get a flavor on this one. It tastes like a straight up coffee bean. I don't like it. Mm-mm. Ew. No. Mm -mm. No, I'm not gonna spit it out. I can't. Okay. Oh wow, that's gross. So I didn't like that one. No. And it doesn't really taste like mocha? tasted like one of those if you guys have ever been to like one of the old time like food lands or shop and saves and they have like that coffee grinder there where you can grind your own coffee my dad has one up at his uh food up at his shop and save rather and you can go into the coffee aisle and grind your own coffee it tasted like you just straightforwardly took a bean out of the coffee bag and without even grinding it and just stuck it in your mouth i didn't like that one no and it didn't really have a mocha taste. I'm no. really disappointed in that one. It was like a coffee bean covered in chocolate. It yeah. was kind of gross. Yeah. So I'm <coughs> going to put an S beside that one because that was definitely... Okay. So you guys are going to see like me talking and then you guys are going to like see a glitch <laughs> and then it's going to go straight to this point. <laughs> Um, my camera decided it wanted to turn off by itself, so I am trying to get a new camera for vlogging. I am going to tell you that. Um, whenever that recording button goes away, that's when it, that's when it stops, I guess. I don't know. Um, so... Okay, we have to make do with what we got for now. So yes. Just um, bear with The us. camera that I want is over $700, so I'm, I don't have that right now. Uh, I am working towards it, though, um... But first things first, I have to get my driver's license and all that other good stuff. 26 years old, don't have my driver's license. I feel imprisoned. Um, so we did the Mocha Madness, yes, as you guys seen. It, we didn't like it. No, it wasn't good. Um, so my next one is Banana. And it has a pretty gold ring around it. So 
That is yours. Thank you. So let's go ahead and try this. I don't like the texture of it. It's got like a gritty texture. Ooh, I like it. I like it a lot because it has the banana. It tastes like a banana runt. With like a hint of chocolate. I like it. Honestly, you want to know my opinion? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what it, we're making this video for. It, it reminds me of medicine. It's got that gritty feel to yeah. it like medicine does. Yeah, it did have a gritty feel to it, but you know what? I liked it. And even the taste. I uh, liked you it. Know. Like, I'm a big banana fan, so. I love banana, but it just, to me, it reminded me of medicine. Sorry. I like it. I liked it. it I think once it stops recording, too, it'll make a beep. It'll make uh, a high-pitched beep. It wasn't, I wouldn't say it was horrible, okay? It kind of had an okay banana taste, but it was kind of gritty. And it does, to me, it just, it was kind of like of a, a, more of a medicine -y taste. I wasn't real crazy about that one. Um. But that's okay, honey. You can, yeah. love, you can love it and I don't have to. Uh, I liked it. So, you know, honestly, if, um, that would be something, uh, I, I think I would, you know, have you guys kind of taste test at the store, see what you thought. You know? Yeah. But. Because we're kind of differing on that one. <laughs> yeah, that one, that one was really different. So this is her number five, I which, do believe. Yes, it is. Which is dark pistachio, which oh. I didn't know when I picked this. He doesn't like pistachios. I hate pistachios. Now, and I didn't realize at the time, I could have picked milk chocolate or dark chocolate. All I seen was the dark chocolate. I, I prefer milk chocolate, but I don't dislike dark chocolate either. So, I But I love pistachios. This one. Uh, here, let me see. Um, They're both the same. <laughs> well, no, this one's a little bit bigger, so I'll try and give you the smaller piece. Uh, okay. Not much smaller, but... Okay. Oh. Uh. Can you taste pistachio? Yeah. But it's not a real overpowering. Ew. Oh, see, I love this. Oh. I just got a really good taste of it, mm -hmm. I love this. Mm -hmm. I had to hurry up and swallow that one. That one was gross. <laughs> I love it. <coughs> oh my god. Mm -mm. You know what? If if chocolate wouldn't kill my parrot, I would give him a little piece of that because he loves pistachios. So I'm going to put <sighs> Missy and Heart. <laughs> heart. Love. Love, 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 love. Mm. So awesome. My next one, which. I picked this because of her. We both like oranges, but she has a really big orange. Mm, like, love, she loves oranges. I love oranges. So, I'm going to give you but the I have ulcers, one of this one. So, I can't eat oranges because of the acid. So, so. fresh orange is what this one's called. Yeah. So, I've been looking forward to this one big time. Wow. That hits you, like, right mm. now. <gasps> Oh my god. Oh my god. It's very, very overpowering, but it is so mm. good. Put a really, big heart on that one, honey. I love really, that one. It really tastes like you just like ripped open an orange and just sucked like, all the juice yeah. out right away. Mm. It's so good. Like you just got the 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 best tasting, freshest orange you could ever imagine. I love that one. That one was so good. I'm mm. actually coloring this heart in. I right seen now. that. Oh my god. <laughs> that one is so awesome. Number six. Mm. On to your mm. number six. Hold on. I forgot it. <laughs> You're savoring it. I'm savoring it. I should have. Mine wasn't big enough. I gave her the bigger piece. See, he's so nice to me because he knows I love oranges. It is still recording, right? Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay, now my next one Whoa. is for us Irish people. Um, and I love, I, as much as I love my mocha coffee, I love Irish coffee too. So... Sorry, I'm getting a bigger piece on this. That's one. fine. <laughs> I've never had Irish cream. Really? Yeah. Well, you can kind of cheat and get the Bailey's uh, non-alcoholic Irish cream for your coffee. And then there's the good, you know, um, alcoholic see, uh, Bailey's Irish cream. And there's, I think, Flanagan's see, or I've something never, like that. I've Irish never cream. had Irish cream. So this is my first time trying it. In chocolate, rather. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I burped. <laughs> yes, you did. And honestly, Irish Irish cream coffee is 
an acquired taste because a lot of people don't don't like it because it's a stronger taste. I love it. I've had this taste somewhere before, but it wasn't an Irish cream. This is good though. It's very good. I'm really loving that. Mm. That's really that good. That is very good. Very, very good. I'm loving that. Mm. <coughs> That's will, definitely really, really good. I will color that hard in, too, because I really like that. that is a I was going to say, because I'm supposed to be getting like 45 minutes, and that wasn't even 17. <laughs> that is a very good, authentic Irish cream taste. Yeah, that was good. I that love was that good. One. I've never had Irish cream, but that was, yeah. So, my next one is the Bam Triple Chocolate. Mm -hmm. So We've been looking forward to this one, too. Yeah. Because... Do you want the one with the white spot, or... Because okay. I'm, I'm assuming white is white chocolate, and you don't like white chocolate. Yeah, I don't, I don't like, like white it. chocolate. So... Bam triple chocolate. We've been looking forward to this one. <sighs> I pause. Because you like, you say something and then you like, and so I'm like, I already have it in my mouth. I'm like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is good. Mm -hmm. I'm glad I took this one because I can taste some of the white chocolate. Can you? Mm -hmm. Good. It's so good. And because I don't like white chocolate, I would have tasted that white chocolate over everything else, and then I would have been disappointed. So she kind of got double chocolate, I got the triple chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> and that's fine. That's fine. So I was... I'm, I don't I don't like white chocolate because it seems so uber I'm sweet gonna, to me. I'm going to put my name on that, because just because of you not liking white chocolate. Yeah. Because that did have definitely a white chocolate acquired taste to it. Yeah. So yeah. This is going to be her number seven. After she takes a drink. <laughs> yeah, because I've got so much, like, chocolate flavor in my mouth. And Okay. Now, this one I cut three slices off because we're... We're, we're going to give our make... cameraman one. Yeah. My son. <laughs> um, this one, I just... <laughs> I... There's a story behind this. I absolutely had to get this one. Long story short... It's, I've never had moonshine in my life, and this is literally called the moonshiner. The moonshiner, and, and I'm hoping it tastes like moonshine, see, because I've had moonshine. I think I was a teenager, and um, my father knew people who used to make moonshine and used to give it to him all the time, and I said something to him one day, and he goes, here! And he hasn't some. had moonshine either, ever, so. so this and is, it's, it's like, uh, woohoo! So, we'll see oh if it God. lives up to the name. Oh my god. Ew. It's like straight up. Can you taste it? <laughs> Ew. Really oh. strong alcohol taste. Mm hmm. I can tell you. Real moonshine. Oh. A lot stronger than that. <laughs> oh. You can taste it? Oh. That was. Oh. I'm glad I'm not the only one that can taste it. That was very powering. Good. It was good, but it was... <laughs> it is good. <laughs> but I can tell you, Chris, Real Moonshine... Mm -hmm. Real Moonshine, if I'm, a, if I'm cringing a, from that, that Moonshine would knock me on my ass. Yes, it would. I, it would I'm not it even would lying. Be, yeah, because Real Moonshine is very, very <coughs> overpowering alcohol. Ooh. Ooh. Um, I, don't, I don't know. I don't think they had... Uh, um, 180 grain out on the market when you could drink because I think at one point they banned it because there was too many alcoholic or you know alcohol related deaths from 180 grain. It's getting all warm. 180 grain actually kind of reminded you of of moonshine a bit. Yeah. The taste and everything. I'm on. That's kind of showing my age. <laughs> we are on number eight. Mine is candy cane. So I'm looking forward to this. I'm looking I forward like... to this too because I love candy canes. Me too. Me too. So that's that moonshine has an after kick too. Oh I yeah. I can still taste that. My, my mouth. face is hot. And I can feel it in my throat. Yeah. Wow. Kick. Wow. It's like a mellower version of that Andy's candy one. Yeah, it is. That was it's good. It is. It's good. I love the mint ones. I do too. It is very mellow. 
It's a, like a very mellowish version. Of, I was expecting it to like really explode. But, but that, it, we, just, it did it on the mint chocolate though, so I'm I'm kind of gathering why it didn't kind of like. Yeah, because then you would just have the same thing. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, it was very mellow. You can kind of taste the candy cane. Like, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Number eight on yours is pina colada. I was looking forward to this one because I like pineapples, so uh, I like and, pineapples and coconut. So yeah, uh, my fa my favorite um, Garth Brooks song. <laughs> and that's every every time I look at this on the on the list, that's what I think of. You know, I mean, I listen to all kinds of music, but I love Garth Brooks. And yeah, I seen this sitting there, and I was like, oh, Garth Brooks, we gotta have that one. <laughs> so, so let's see if this tastes like a pina colada. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I'm getting stuck on the shelf. <laughs> oh, alcohol. Oh. Yeah, I think I'm tasting more of the alcohol than that. Oh, oh, no. Ew. Oh. <coughs> it's like hanging right here. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's hanging. That's it's just, yeah. That was strong. Yeah. I don't cringe at much, but that, that, it's strong. Very strong. I don't, I only cringe at strong, strong tastes. And That's I've all cringed, I tasted I've, was the alcohol. Yeah. I've cringed about two or three times only because the flavors were strong. Yeah. I didn't taste any... I didn't taste any coconut, any... Nothing. Nothing. Just it was the just alcohol. alcohol straightforward. Like, yeah. boom. Yeah. I didn't wow. taste anything except for the alcohol. Yeah, that was... I didn't like that. <coughs> No, I didn't like that one either. So the next one, mm. <coughs> my number nine, is Mango. Ew. Ew. <laughs> so, mm. Give me this one is going to be a mango. I, I already took a sip, but i got to take another one because yeah, I can't that. get that out of my mouth. It was strong. Mm -hmm. It is still recording. It was right, way too, way too strong. All right. So, this, this is, is mango. Is, I love mango. I love mango. Oh, my God. Mm. That's like a... Kick right to your mouth of mango. It's such so a good. nice, smooth texture. Oh my god. Mm. Oh my god. I'm savoring this one. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Mm. Wow. That was so good. I like that one. I like that one a lot. So, I seen. Uh, mm, speaking big, of mango. Big heart on that one. Yeah. Speaking of mango, I. When we went to Annie Ann's yesterday. Now Annie Ann's is a pretzel shop that is in our mall, and I I've hand been trying rolled. hand yeah. rolled handmade pretzels, and I was trying to go and get a mango strawberry banana smoothie combined. The guy gave me an attitude and said that I wasn't we allowed to have it. it. Yeah, we can't do that because blah 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 blah. But meanwhile, they had to measure the stuff that went in it anyways. Now I followed this guy on YouTube. He's a big YouTube sensation. His name is Lance Stewart. Um, he gets mango banana smoothies all the time. And I've always wanted to try one. And every time I try to get one, I can't ever get it or I can't ever find it. So if you guys <coughs> ever have Excuse had me. a mango banana smoothie or a mango strawberry banana smoothie, let me know how it is because I definitely want to know where you got it and how it tastes because I, I really want to know. I couldn't make one at home. We probably could, but that, that would be like I don't know. Be... Okay, so that's the next next shout out thing. If yeah, you guys have a good a good recipe, get a hold of us. Yeah. Uh, send us your recipe. Maybe we could try yeah. it. Out. Yeah, you know? that would that would definitely be awesome too. Mango smoothies. Man uh, yeah. Orange well, smoothies recipes. Anything, maybe we we know? might even do a taste testing stuff. So if you guys really want to go and do like, you know, whatever. Like if you guys want to. Leave recipes down in the bottom if it's easy to if it's easy to make. We might do a taste testing thing on it too, and then we'll give you a shout out as well. Yeah, because so. I know I get you know you know how we all do different things on Facebook. I get different recipes off of Facebook, and I try yeah. them. I've so. done it a couple times. That's where I got my Kit Kat lasagna. I made it for my sister's birthday. That's a, that's never diabetes had, in a pan. I've never had that. You're gonna have to make that for me. <laughs> <coughs> That's how I made my little Philly things on Sunday oh, before yeah. the Steeler game. Mm -hmm. That was really good. 
So number nine on hers oh, is... Oh, it's my turn? Yes. Oh, okay. Number nine. Oh, chocolate cheesecake. Oh, I, we were both looking forward yeah, to this. Yeah, Because any kind of cheesecake to us is amazing. <gasps> oh, my God. When we went to New York, you know, for the Walking Dead premiere, and then we spent the weekend up in New York, oh, my God, I got a New York strawberry cheesecake. Oh, my God. You want to talk about that? To die for. <laughs> oh, my God. That was to die for. Yeah. Oh, so yeah, I'm looking forward to this. So let's go. Chocolate <laughs> cheesecake. This is about to be disappointing. I think so too. That's disappointing. All I taste is chocolate. I don't really taste a cheesecake thingy at all. I mean, you can taste the like the sugary like I can taste it. I can taste like the sugary ish of like a cheesecake but the taste is not even there like the texture of the sugar but it just tastes like straight chocolate all that I, one's not good yeah all I honestly all I taste is a little bit of regular chocolate a little bit of white chocolate yeah that's all I taste I didn't like it uh, no no that's not uh, no. <laughs> you said, oh, no. Yeah, uh, 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 don't let me call you on that one. Sorry. This one is definitely going to be strong. I can tell right now. It's called gingerbread. So, oh, look, I'm already trying to mark it off. <laughs> <laughs> I, that's, I don't think, nah, nah, that's not nice. I don't think I'm going to like this one. So, this is gingerbread. Let's Which can it. be strong. You yeah. Know, so. so. It's strong. Uh, oh took, my I, God. Uh, Yeah, I took two bites. It's already strong. No. Yeah. Mm. Ew. Oh. That was like straight. Two bites and it was already. Hoo hoo. Yeah, no. Wow. No. I, I had a little little piece that didn't come out when I spit that out and it's. Here, I am. I'm going to actually cut a piece off for the cameraman. You have to try this. This is. He might like it. It is very, very strong. Very strong and ginger. <laughs> and I like clove. I can taste the clove, but I taste more of the ginger than the clove. Do you want to be on the video? No. Okay. I was he's gonna camera put, shy. I was going to put him on the video, but he doesn't want to be on the video, so. Yeah, he's camera shy. So. It's not that bad, It's in my opinion. Oh, yeah, That was See, gingery. Yeah. Very, I very. I thought it was very gingery. It's a very strong ginger. <laughs> yeah, but. Oh, no. Where's that Well, pencil? that's okay, because, <laughs> because that, that's a third opinion. See? So, my son likes it. He said it wasn't too bad, but him and I thought it was... Good. Okay. Sorry for the glitch again, guys. It stopped again. My camera has a mind of its own right now. So, she was talking about how strong the gingerbread taste was. Or the ginger, actually. Yeah, not... the ginger. Yeah. And she misspelled that one, too. It says ginger. Ginger. Gingerbread. Gingerbread. <laughs> so, I put a big X to it, and then I said no... So, but Jonathan, Jonathan, John, yeah, sorry, I shook the table. <laughs> I kicked the table. <laughs> um, Jonathan, who's our cameraman, um, said it wasn't too bad. He kind of liked it. So, yeah. I guess it depends on it, if you like ginger. Ginger, yeah, yeah, just ginger in general. Like, yeah, because I was really um, trying not to spit out anything, but that one was a yeah, worthy two bites, spit out. Two bites, and I was done. That one was a worthy spit out. So, yeah. your number 10 is oh, um, sea salt. <gasps> Sea salt caramel. Oh, I, I love, love caramel. <laughs> and I, I love sea salt caramel. So. so I love caramel. So this ought to be so, really good. Let's try it. Hopefully it's not a disappointment. I'm not tasting any sea salt. I can taste the caramel. Oh, yeah, a little but bit. it kind of lacks on the caramel too. Yeah, it's more chocolate than anything. Mm -hmm. So this one was a. It was a so-so. Eh? It was a so-so. I wouldn't. Soft. I wouldn't get it again because when she said sea salt caramel, I instantly thought of like if you guys ever had the Ben and Jerry's, um, core ice cream. Like my favorite is the double chocolate peanut butter core, peanut butter fudge core is what it's called, by Ben and Jerry's and. Oh, we're giving a lot of name shout outs on this. Yeah, this yeah. I, hey, we should start getting paid, I think. Here we are. <laughs> we need royalties here. Right? <laughs> but um, they also make one called Sea Salt Caramel Core, and that was very, very caramely. And 
like, I made the stupid mistake of actually leaving the core for last and actually taking a big heaping spoonful of the caramel, and I almost threw up. I, it literally gagged me because of Folgers, how much sea salt and caramel it was. I think my Folgers coffee has <clears throat> more caramel taste than that thing. Yeah, it? that one wasn't, eh. Yeah. That was, eh. Yeah. I wouldn't get it again, but, I mean, I didn't like it. Yeah. It was so, just, yeah. <coughs> It, it was really nothing to write him to mom about, you know. Yeah, yeah. that one wasn't. Eh. So our next one, not which is number eleven, but the, we're on to our add-ons now. So yeah, um, this one is almonds. I think this one's gonna be good. I like almonds. I like almond joys, so hopefully this tastes like an almond joy. Uh, I hope so. not, cause I, well, yeah, okay, cause as long as I don't have to taste the texture of coconut, I'm fine. Oh. I don't like the texture. I like um. What's his it's name? Almond. Like it's Tallahassee. <laughs> and my favorite zombie land. I love Woody Harrelson in that. It's straight chocolate. Like almond. It tastes like a chocolate covered almond. Mm. I like it. Yeah. It was good. Have you ever seen Zombie Land? I haven't. Yeah, me too. I love when they find a hostess truck. <laughs> Uh, fucking uh, snowballs. <laughs> my, my, John, Justin, Justin, my oldest one, always teases me. Who that. likes fucking? <coughs> I choked on my <laughs> foot. <laughs> <laughs> Who likes fucking snowballs? <laughs> I hate coconut. Not the taste, the consistency. And I tell everybody that. And I, I had for a long time, even before that movie. <laughs> so my oldest one. Who I just calls me Tallahassee all the time. Sudden taste of like that. Whatever alcohol one that you had that tasted like straight alcohol. Oh, uh, what one was that? Oh, that was the pina colada. Oh my god, was, I still have that taste in my yeah, mouth. Yeah, I, I just got a it. big taste of it. It's like sitting right yeah. in my throat. And my just, face is so warm right now. I can't get rid of that taste. I hate it. So we are it's on gross. her first add-on, which is toasted coconut. Oh. And I like the fact that I don't have to have the consistency of coconut because I love the taste of coconut. Just don't like well, at least she said it doesn't have the consistency. Yeah, it, because so. I asked her. I said if it has you know. the consistency, someone's about to be salty. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, because I can outcuss a sailor sometimes, so I'll try to be careful. Okay, there it is. I'm waiting for my coconut. <laughs> The lime and the coconut and take it all around. <laughs> where, I had a where little, the hell was my coconut? I had a little bit of a hint of it, but not much. I could taste it because I like coconut and I was I really trying I love to find the taste it. Of coconut. I was trying to mm. find it. I can't. I, I'm. So maybe, I mean, we're tasting so many chocolates here, guys, so I don't know like if we're just having too many and we're not finding the actual like flavors of anything but i mean no because that's why i'm waiting till yeah. i get through most of it before i comment on anything and giving it a chance but uh, we're not really finding anything in no, almost I, any of these like we we've had some that has been really really strong and really good. really good but there's like two flavors so far in each one of ours that doesn't really have the flavor we expect. And I think we're just expecting too much, maybe. Maybe. Or they're I just so subtle that it's, you know, I don't know. Okay, so the next one is Amaretto. I'm going to let her take a drink first. The next one is Amaretto, which, again, is an alcoholic beverage or a mixer. Or a coffee. It's a mixer. Yeah, it's a mixer for a coffee. I'm gonna put an X on the on the coconut because I couldn't so, even taste it. Oh my it. god, I'm burping up a storm over here. Okay, give me a minute, honey, because that's that's fine. I got all this chocolate taste in my mouth, and I'm like, I'm covered and that in chocolate. Stupid peanut colada, mm -hmm. like li liquor flavor in the back of my throat. Just like licking the the access like candy shell like melted onto my finger off this one has an alcoholic flavor to it this, uh, and, and i'm okay with that as long as it's not overbearing it's and that pina colada was very overbearing yeah, this one's about to be a little overbearing oh okay so this should be fun then let's try it oh
Ew. That's alcohol. Mm -hmm. Straight. That tasted like a pina colada. Mm -hmm. That's how oh, I'm Oh, my tasting. throat's burning. Yeah. That's not one I think I would get again. Ew, no. My grandma's going to have a lot of fun tasting these. <laughs> Poor Grammy. <laughs> okay, so we are officially done with my list. So, <clears throat> the last one on her list. After she's finished. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> this one is... Oh, this one's about to be good. Yeah. I think... Isn't it one more coffee? It's in the coffee one. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we have... This is our last one, and I'm so happy it's a coffee one. So hopefully this tastes a lot more... Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Yeah, I don't think there was too many... <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, back of the throat thing, it's still... Um, oh, scared me. <laughs> my phone went off. <laughs> um, I don't think there was too many left that uh, out of the flavors that we didn't really... We literally had about maybe four or five that we did not get. We literally bought them out of like, bought yeah. one bar of each flavor, so... Yeah, I think there was only about four, uh, no, five, I think, we figured. Yeah. Now, this is uh, a latte macchiato mm -hmm. flavor. I'll give you the bigger piece. Okay. So, oh, wow. Oh, my God, I still got... Uh, I know. That alcohol flavor. So. Okay. Oh my god. That really tastes like it. That is spot on. That's a hit. Yeah. That wow. is spot on. That tastes exactly. If So if you guys like a latte macchiato, that is spot on for It tasted it. like a vanilla bean kind of caramely. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so good. That had more caramel flavor than the freaking caramel, the salt, 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 caramel yeah. one that you had. Mm-hmm. So that one, that one is so, that one's spot on. You know, if you're getting a latte macchiato coffee, mm -hmm. I see, mean, I've never you, had if, a latte macchiato. If but you took a bite so of that, good. you would swear you just took a sip of that coffee. That is just so spot on. So good though. It is really good. All right, guys. So absolutely, overall, this absolutely. taste testing thing was it really was good. A thumbs up. Thumbs down, maybe yeah. like in the middle. But yeah, about half and half on the yeah. flavors. I mean, don't get me wrong. Um, I would uh, go back for some of them. Oh yeah, definitely. I mean, it's a good, it's a good candy. Um, but if there's some that you're really not sure about, they do allow uh, taste Tastes. testing right there. I would definitely yeah. taste test so you're not. Yeah. You know. You're not buying a flavor outright like we did, but we did it for you guys. So yeah, like this is this. my YouTube channel, so I pretty much had the idea to do it. So yeah. I did it. I did it. Wanted to do it for you guys, and I invited her along, and she was cool with it. So, and you guys probably will be seeing more of her in my videos, um, along with Christian. Sometimes maybe my sister. Sometimes you know, depending on what the challenge is, because there's some challenges that she can't do or. You know that other challenges you know christian might be able to do or my sister might be able to do so yeah sorry i don't do jelly beans <laughs> yeah no that was that was my very first video i've ever did guys that was a bean boozle challenge it was the worst challenge and ever he did ask me and I, but i said oh, and I i'm hate still jelly beans i'm still to this day trying to get somebody to do the um other bean boozle challenge with me that i have at my house so i mean i'm trying to get somebody this weekend maybe um so, I don't know. We'll see how that goes. But overall, this video was like a half and half. So, I mean, let's... They are why don't we do it this way? Why don't you guys tell me what you guys thought? And either get a hold of me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. And, you know, let me know what you guys thought. And if you guys have any ideas, you're free. feel free to message me on any one of those sites as well. Leave a comment down below, and if I do not get back to your comment, and I tell everybody this in almost every video I'm starting now, with every single video that I post, I'm going to start telling people this. If I do not respond to your comment, please feel free to message me on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter so you can get a response back. Um, do you have anything else to add? Um... Not that I can think of offhand. Oh, this is my first video. So, um, <laughs> kind of a newbie at all this. So okay. So but I did I enjoy mean, myself, and you know, I hope I hope this was helpful. Yeah, I mean, I, it was it was good. I look forward to doing it again. Yeah. Um. Mm -hmm. 
So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, once again, my Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, her Facebook, everything's going to be listed down below. If I do forget to put anything down below, comment on it or get a hold of me on Facebook or something and let me know what you guys want to see, what you guys want us to do. Nothing fatal, nothing injury prone, yeah. nothing like that because I will refuse it instantly. Um, <coughs> yeah, like taste testing some, some reasonable stuff. Taste here, guys, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Taste testings, challenges, uh, makeup challenges. I like doing those. Um, uh, just, you know, whatever. So let me know what you guys think. And Have a I good will night, guys. Talk to you guys later.